Here's our first group of chefs. I'm Kiana, I'm in 12th grade and I draw. I'm Melissa, I'm a senior and I'm in your book. <laughs> I'm Nikki, I'm a senior and I work at Party City. I'm Christian, I'm a sophomore and I like to play basketball. And here we have our second group of chefs. Hi, my name is Vincent and I'm a junior. Some of my favorite um, activities are to play on my Nintendo Switch. No, and I'm David, a sophomore, and her activity is baseball. Uh, I'm CJ Zach, I'm a sophomore, and my favorite activity is volleyball. Uh, my name is Kay, I'm a junior, I like to play basketball. Finally, we have our third group of chefs. My name's Sam, I'm a freshman, and I like to skate. My name's Trini, I'm a junior, and I play softball. Hi, my name is Angela, I'm in 10th grade, and I like to draw. My name is Ethan, and I like to play tennis. Greens found your basket. Please open up the basket. Okay. In the basket you'll find pork chops, wow. red bell peppers, <laughs> and spinach. Okay. Have an idea. Team two, what do you have planned? So for like the pork chops, we could um, um, well, we could pan fry it with like garlic, rosemary, and like pepper and salt. Um, I was thinking for the garlic and the bell peppers, we can uh, saute them in a garlic rosemary. Wait, I mean, no, we could. The rosemary will be for the pork chops, and I think the garlic will be for the pork chop and the spinach and red bell peppers. And we can just saute that for a bit. What do you guys think? Team three, what are your thoughts on the ingredients? Um, so I think the spinach is kind of like ugly and big so maybe we should like steam it because it's going to reduce in size a lot and I think that would be good and with the bell pepper um, I don't know how good it is I've never tried a bell pepper but maybe we should put it into a puree not on like the plate itself and then just skillet cook our pork chops with like some marin marinade them of course like some garlic salt pepper like the basic <laughs> And here are our judges for today. I'm Mr. Bonds. I'm a counselor here at Foothill. I'm Ms. Zelayo. I'm a Spanish teacher here at Foothill. I'm Mrs. Bossy. I'm a chemistry teacher here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah. Yeah. We're done with the butter. Right? <laughs> 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 Good job. Fishing one hit my nose immediately, so I'm just going to see how their taste turns out. And it looks like they have um, either milk or cream, so they're going to make a thick sauce, which sounds delicious, with garlic and spinach, maybe. <laughs> um, I assume they did because I already see it anywhere else on the I don't really see it anywhere else on the TV. <laughs> <laughs> We're done with this, right? Pan fried 
a pan fried. It was a pan fried garlic rosemary pork chop with butter and it was garlic butter and we have a sauteed um, sauteed bell pepper and spinach garlic saute. <laughs> Definitely taste the garlic and the butter. Not too much. I feel like it was perfect. Um, I will say, however, uh, spinach. I love spinach, but it's soggy. We'll have to agree with the spinach at the point. I do like the bell peppers. I think that they're not bad. Um, pork chop, I think it's a little, a little dry. But overall, I like the presentation. I like a little touch with the roast A garlic, salt, and um, fresh herb and paprika marinated. Um, skillet cooked pork chop with a red pepper puree as the sauce, and then just a steamed spinach. Garnished with the time. Camera rolling. Action. Well. I want to say thank you to all the chefs. I know times was the essence. However, Kitchen One, you did a great job. Um, again, the pork chop was as well. Um, however, uh, the vegetables weren't cooked uh, to our liking. Yeah, Kitchen Two as well. I think we did a really good job. Uh, I really love the presentation. I think they put a lot of effort, uh, a lot of effort actually, uh, the presentation. I like that. A little touch of the rosemary. Kitchen 3 did a great job. The Camera. Rolling. Was Action. Great. The bell puree was great. Camera. Rolling. Action. But again, you guys did a fantastic well, uh, job. I want to say thank you so we decided to go with chefs. Kitchen 3. All the times was the essence. However, Kitchen 1 did a great job. And again, the pork chop was as well. Um, however, yeah, the vegetables weren't set. Let's food. go! Yeah, Kitchen 2 as well. I think we did a really good job. Uh, I really love the presentation. I think they put a lot of effort, uh, a lot of effort actually, uh, the presentation. I like that. A little touch of the rosemary. Kitchen 3 did a great job. The texture and cook on the pork chop was great. Thank you, chefs. Okay. Okay, so yeah, just make sure you, you this, this goes for both judges and chefs. Make sure you project your voice and just speak up uh, on that so we get good audio. Okay? Jesse, go. whenever you're ready. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Good? Yeah, I'm good. We're ready. Okay. Quiet on set, please. Sound. Speed. Camera. Rolling. Action. Good morning. Today we have prepared Sauce. Thank you. Thank you. Cut. <laughs>
Let's uh, reset the plates. Uh, group one, grab your plates and bring them here. Everybody behind Chris. We could please move out of shot. You guys are just way too close. Abraham, Kitchen two. Especially Eric. Eric. So when uh, they're shooting, right? Don't go behind Chris because we could, we might be able to see you in a shot. Right? I can yeah. see you right now. Not a lot of Okay, so Chris, are you gonna be? All right, you're good. Okay, you're good. Everybody, you good? Kai, are you okay? Yes. All right. Quiet on set, please. Sound, <coughs> speed, speed, camera, rolling, action. Hi, so, um, we...
It's like almost like that. I love that. That could be that. Are you done? Jess, please step back from your kitchen.